Hi there, so I got this Drake R4B calibrator board in the mail because I wasn't able to, uh, I didn't think I would fix my board, so here's the schematic of the board here. You can see how it works by looking at the schematic right there. Um, so I'm powering it right across this, um, right across this capacitor. So here's the capacitor. You see that C120? No, that's not it. They actually have a um, little power supply on board this thing. So you're taking filament voltage and rectifying it. Actually, no. These guys, Drake, as somebody said, likes to take B+. So they're taking, they're taking B+, and they're putting it through a resistor. Anyway, the power for this thing is coming in. Actually, no, this is wrong. They don't do this. They're, they're taking the power from this little power supply here. Sorry about that. So let me see. The power comes in where? I got this figured out, but... Okay, so yeah, it manufactures power from the filaments. There's the filaments. There's the power. The power goes right up into the oscillator. It looks like this diagram is inaccurate. It looks like they're also powering this from, from here. Anyway, so anyway, I'm, I'm injecting power right across that capacitor right there. See, 192. So here's how I have the board set up. I'm powering it off of four AA cells. And everything's grounded. So where do you got to connect things? Well, this pin here, so note the capacitor, the variable capacitor, and note this pin here. This pin has to be grounded to turn on the calibrator. So that's going to be grounded. Obviously, you want to ground that. Um, I'm taking off the scope from the crystal itself. So I have the scope probe connected to the actual crystal that's running on this thing. And this ground here goes to where? That's my scope ground there. Okay, so on the top, all I'm really doing is injecting power. I'm injecting power into the... Uh, into the capacitor here, which is rated at 6 volts. So I'm running about 5 volts into it, I guess. And that's about it. So to, ch to totally test this thing, inject 5 volts at the capacitor, ground the pin that the switch on the front of the Drake grounds in calibration mode. That's this pin here. Make sure that pin's grounded. And the grounds, of course, are on these uh, tabs that were broken off on this board and take your signal from the crystal itself. So with that said, here's what we do. I'm just gonna power it up with a, a power lead here. And the red one, of course, you should use for power. So it's right here. Whoops. And I actually had that on a meter. So let's put it back on this meter. I have the meter in, in current mode here. So that's what I get for forgetting about the meter. So here's the meter. Connect it back up. There, now I'm on the meter. So when I attach the meter to the power here on the batteries, the board fires up. There it is. It's drawing 58 milliampers at four volts. And the board's working, there's the scope. So power off, power on, power off, power on. There you go. So that's the uh, output of the crystal. So the whole board, I guess, is working. At least the crystal's working. So what does the board use when it's not running? That's, that's a curiosity. So it uses 58 mils running. If we take off the uh, ground here, so the switch is now from calibrate to uh, some other position. Now we check the board again for the draw and see what it draws when it's idling. So when the board, board idles, it <laughs> It's taken 57.2 mils, so it doesn't matter if it's running or not. It's going to suck about about 58 mils. Isn't that nice? So, so much for green energy with the Drake R4B. Anyway, there it is again. And there's my 58 mils. There's our 100 kC signal from the crystal. And that's about it. So I'll go again. I'll go through the connections again. 
course you want to ground to the uh, ground here with your scope and ground with the uh, power supply and really you just want to inject the power supply into the capacitor on top right there where the red is on the plus put the power into there and take the scope off the crystal do the scope off the crystal right there and you want to ground this pin here this is your calibration switch here so when you are going like this, you're saying, you're saying calibrate on, calibrate off, calibrate on. Okay. If I could see how to connect that with the camera in my hand. There, just like that. Okay. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.